Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to try out Hungry Lamu. Now, I don't I have no idea what this game uh, is about uh, and uh, why it's a horror game. We seem to be in some kind of forest uh, in canyon like uh, with some stones, trees uh, and grass and this. I know this is why I was preparing to record this video. If you squint a little closer, that's a face. Anyway, let's begin. Okay. Hello, Lamu. You had a good nap, didn't you? Oh dear, looks like somebody's hungry. Let's go find some food for that big stomach of yours, Lamu. Okay, we are Lamu. There is a narrator, we can move. Uh, we seem to be some kind of cave. With some leftover food and some paper. Okay, the paper is interesting. Um, oh, okay, we are out. Oh, isn't it a beautiful day, Lamu? Let's find some cherries to put in that stomach of yours. Eat three cherries. Okay. Uh, so we are in some kind of valley. Those are cherries. Okay. Uh, I don't think those were cherries. There aren't any cherries beyond this point. Okay, cool. Um, so let's go down, maybe. This is a wall. Uh, let's see. There are cherries, kind of. Okay, we got them. Uh, some more, maybe down here. Yes, perfect. Yum! Weren't those cherries delicious? But Lamu is still hungry. Cherries are not enough for Lamu's stomach. Huh? Oh? What's that? Well, if it isn't a cute little banana. That's a banana. Lamu loves fruits. I'm sure this banana wouldn't mind helping Lamu. Okay. Let's go meet this banana. Lamu. Meet? Okay. Eat the banana. Okay. Uh, sure. Let's eat the banana. Talk to banana. Hello, little banana. Is it a dog? It's a dog. Oh dear. Looks like I was wrong. The banana is very selfish and doesn't want to help Lamu. It's also alive. We'll need to make the banana sleep so that Lamu can have a delicious meal. Need something hard. <laughs> okay. The axe? No. No axe. Um, take rock. We took a rock. We, we are very murderous, Lamu. Hit banana. Ah! Hit banana. Oh! What a hearty meal. I'm sure the banana didn't mind. Despite its sour attitude, it tastes very sweet. However, there's still some space in Lamu's big stomach. Mm -hmm. Oh? What's that, Lamu? People? <laughs> it's a bunch of fruit friends. We don't see a lot of them around here. Their fruits should be enough to fill up Lamu's stomach. Let's go say hi to them, Lamu. Okay, let's put the rock away. Let's not uh, seem too murderous yet. Oh. Okay, they, they were scared from the start. Eh? Looks like they want to play a game. Just like the other fruit friends we met in the past. How fun! Come on, Lamu. Let's find our new friends so we can have some, some of their delicious fruits. Okay. I don't like this. Those are some bees. Huh? Need some, some stinges. Okay. Take bee nest. Uh oh. They're all bees. Find apple. Ouch! The bees stung me everywhere. Looks like I've got to be careful next time. Careful next time. Have my apple. You bees there a bit.
Okay. Uh, let's get the X. <laughs> Take X. Nice. We got the X. What's next? Uh, let's see. Anyone here? Yes. Something hot. Okay. Need something hot. What about the other guy? Uh, I don't remember which one was was it. Ah, there we go. Swing axe. Get down. There we go. Find orange. Whoa, that was a high fall. Did you know oranges give you tons of energy? Have mine. Maybe next time you'll be able to climb a tree too. Cool. I just... <laughs> just... Just an orange. They're just oranges. Did not... Alive. Uh, anyway. That's a car. Smash car. Okay, not yet. Um... I need something hot. Do I need to smash the car? To get something hot? Smash car. Don't say to fire from home. Lamu will get lost. Okay. I smashed the car. That did nothing. Cool. Uh, what about down here? There's nothing. Cool. Uh, let's go up then. Okay. Nothing out here. Something hot. Huh? Hmm. Oh wait, the fire. Of course. Can I not can I not pick up the fire? Of course we cannot pick up the fire. Oh there we go. Stick. We got something fire. Oh, we got something fire. We got something hot. Let's burn down on this bush. There we go. Find pear. Pear. It's hot, 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 hot. Oh, jeez. Couldn't you try something less burning? Well, I hope you like burnt pear and pear because it's all yours. Yum, yum, yum. Weren't your fruit friends just delicious, Lamu? What a great day. Playing with friends, eating delicious fruits, and having such fun. And eating your friends. Uh, today was a marvelous day, wasn't it, Lamu? Oh? What's that, Lamu? You are still hungry? What the hell? Sounded like Tasha. I told them not to make so much uh, ruckus. Let's see what they're after. Oh no! Oh no! The flash is absolutely useless. Huh? Oh no, what is this? Let's go beyond here. Park car here, follow trailer. P area. Keep an eye on Mochi. L Leon is hot. The poo poo head. Meet at 12 a.m. Lamu for his park. Okay. What is this? There's a campfire. I can run. Hello? Come on here. Anyone? Hello? Where did they go? Can we... I'm hearing something. Our, our run power is not that big. Campsite isn't this way. I am at the campsite. What are you talking about? Oh, there we go. Where did they all go? Where's Machi? Machi, where are you girl? 
She couldn't have run off too far. Huh. Follow trail. Cursed cave. Okay. Maybe this way. Okay, nope. Not that way. I don't want to go where it says do not go. Paint AM. Very cool. Oh no. Machi! Machi? What the f who did this? Poor girl. Which of you uh, did this? This f up? Tasha, Ken, Leon. What the hell are you guys? Find your three friends. Sure. Let's find my three friends. If they're still alive. I hope the... Lamu isn't that... Oh god. What was that? Nope. 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 Uh, I don't see anything. The game doesn't even pause when I escape. Oh. What was that? What? Hello? Anyone? You playing tricks on me? What is this? Guys? I hate this. I hate this so much. Like... The thing that I don't understand is... Is it scripted then? Or... That's a cave. Is this a curse cave they keep talking about? <laughs> Shit, better say better safe in there than out here. Not really. Okay. <laughs> uh that's a skull. Hello. The llama is hungry. Only fruit. Miss Mum Evil. Surprise, today is Rama's birthday. His mom and dad made him a delicious fruit cake. Oh my, Mum and Dad, that, what a nice surprise. Rama was excited. I didn't know you both could bake. Children's book? Rama is hungry. Lamu is hungry. Monster. Larry. Look at that. That belongs to Larry. It's a new day today. Everybody is waking up. Lama is the, sun, the sunshine and wakes up with a big yawn. It's a daily routine for this young animal to wake up well rested at the break of dawn. It, uh, it has a little hat. Rumble, rumble. Lama's stomach growls. Like, looks like Lama's hungry for some fresh food. Oh dear me. What's... That's the sign to go, Lama said. Time for, for some breakfast. I sure hope it's good. What is this? <laughs> okay. Uh, Miss Home. RP. Lama leaves his home, whistling as he walks, thinking of the adventure to find his meal. Tweet, 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 tweet. He whistles gleefully. Overwhelming euphoria is what he truly feels. How rude of me, Lama says. Delicious fruit, truly tasty. Himself satisfied with his feast, at home, best not be lazy. 
those are foots, they are foots, they are foots, they are foots, they are not foots. <laughs> Spoiler, they're not foots. Oh, there we go. Burp, how, oh my, how you the mean, Brahma says. Oh, the delicious foot. Okay, a page is ripped out. Um, uh, Pat himself. Oh, heads home. No more home. Run away. Lama walks back home. Belly very full. He reaches his home just when the moon rose. He entered the door with a smile on his face. But with his son accent made him suck a pose. Dr. Burns exposes fraud. Dr. Eric Burns. What is going on? Dr. Eric Burns, well known for his studies on interspecies, interspecies genetics and fusion, has recently been exposed for fraud, as his most recent studies and findings were proven to be falsified. What? Interspecies genetics? In the fifth of April, Dr. Burns revealed his findings of human animal genetic fusion, allowing scientists to retrieve specific DNA from animals and placing it from into the human body, allowing humans to have traits specific to animals. With this gun making discovery, it was a vision that cures the incredible diseases that could be produced. The discovery sounded too good to be real, which is in this case, unfortunately, uh, is not. Upon further evaluation, Dr. Burns' findings and studies were further evaluated. Other additions to return the same findings were self falsified. Okay. Some guy did weird stuff with uh, animals and uh, humans, uh, and uh, it was not real. All your fault, I did not want anymore. After a long day and a fun time, Lama had to bed. He tucked himself into his warm blanket. He thought himself what a fun day, reminiscing about tomorrow's banquet. The end. Still hungry. What the hell is going on? Ha! <clears throat> I was expecting a, a jump scare there. It still got me. Tale 3. All the stories. Murder at Bronze Residence. At around 2,100 hours, loud noises were heard with, within the Bronze Residences. Concerned neighbors immediately dialed for emergency service to inspect the concerning incident. What authorities found in the lovely home was absolutely terrifying. Bronze family was well established within their friendly neighborhood, well likely by their neighbors and even, even having occasional get-togethers. Eric Burns, 52, Tina Burns, 51, and uh, we're a happy family of three. Uh, probably Larry Burns, I would assume, because the children book was Larry's. Uh, oh, wait, is the llama Larry? Did Eric turn his own son into a llama? Am I reaching? Besides Dr. B Eric Burns' exposure of fraudulent scientific findings, six months ago, the family lived with no gadgets against any other people and minded their own business. It has come to shock you that on Saturday night, Dr. Eric and Tina Burns were found brutally murdered in their own homes with the body missing from the terrifying crime scene. Dr. Eric and Tina Burns' heads were detached from their bodies, laid across the floor, nowhere near their necks. The living room was a mess with furniture thrown about, flipped over. The graphic scene immediately triggered the authorities to conduct a thorough investigation on the gruesome incident. Families are advised to stay indoors and lock any form of entry into their residential buildings for the time being. The authorities ensure the public that everything will be handled properly and swiftly. A search party has been conducted by the authorities to look for the young Larry, dead or alive. It is still unknown who or what could have committed this horrendous act, although we are all afraid it is strongly advised to follow the authorities' orders in order to maintain not only our safety but all our loved ones as well. I can only hope that the culprit will be put in hand soon. Let me support the to shine. Anyways, I'm a young child, please support it. Okay. Cool. So, the first ending. Uh, I don't know how to get the other endings. Uh, so, I'm going to stop here. And uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Very fun. Very cool. I did not expect the 3D uh, turnaround. And it was uh, in very interesting. The story was actually way deeper than I thought it would be. Um, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.